Okay, hello and welcome back to OpenTTD. Sorry that the last episode cut off a bit quick. Um, anyway, so uh, since the last episode I've done a bit more editing, I've added a few more airports in which we can go round and uh, have a look at. You can see I've sort of taken off in the company value world, but that will most likely go down. Let's find income. So yeah, my income is getting very close to what theirs used to be. So uh, that's that's a, hopefully a good defeat for them. Anyway, so um, what I thought I'd do is just take this opportunity to well uh, try and take a f oh no no don't tell me they've lost their faith in me. Um, how much would a large advertising bribe the local authority large advertising fund let's go for a large advertising fund that's not really done much right let's bribe the local authority oh my god that's a lot of money and we can't really waste that much money because we need to, even though we've got 10 million pounds uh, I suppose that's a feasible. It's, oh, let's go down the tree option. I hate this option because it just means you get trees everywhere. But apparently, it's very popular with the townspeople. Let's just round that this airport. This horrible, disgusting looking airport of trees. Shall we? That will make them feel happier. And it'll give me an opportunity to put my plan to action. So, if we have a look at what Pard Hatton councillor saying about us now, or let's see if that means we can build a bus depot right here to take passengers from their um, airport, and right here to take passengers from the middle of town and we're going to buy about 10 buses I think two, oh, one, two, three, four, five. let's go for five shall we although I actually uh, have made a slight error if we sell 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 just open up that bus so he's going to go to Harderton South Parterton transfer and then he'll head up to Parterton International Airport where he'll transfer and take cargo so hopefully building up Parterton more than it is um, the Tef Tenfingberg, where um, the airport actually is, officially. But anyway, so let's clone this vehicle. Let's have five of them. Five, that's good. They should all have the same instructions. So, out they go. Uh, also, we have the... Uh, Iron ore. Is this from this company? Uh, I don't know where they'd get the iron ore from, so we'll have to leave that for now. Unless there's a, a mine somewhere along this line. I don't think there is. Rumford's still hating us. Yeah. Well, that's fine, because we can just leave them hating us. There's a coal company. I take it that's delivering. Ah, that's good. So that's obviously where some of our money is going from. I uh, don't think there are any factories. But let's have a look at how our profits are coming along. Apart from the plus 9 billion. Uh, which is probably actually a good thing because if we look at the amount we spent on new vehicles, we would have 
bankrupt pretty quick if it just been uh, if it just been relying on the money oh, can you just shut up go away go away please thank you yeah if we'd just been relying on money from uh, Yeah, the company that we took over. I need to turn the sound down because that is just too loud. Yeah, we wouldn't have got very far. But anyway, so those. Right, this is really. Well. Right, so um, now I've got a load of buses that are just doing the rounds. Hopefully, making us a bit of money. They don't appear to be. You can see I've done a sort of drive in route around here. In fact, I might make it a one way street. Then a one way street out. That should just ease up a bit of congestion. Anyway, I'm just thinking about whether we need to put, start building a second railway line. Um, that's great news. Uh, because, I mean, as you can see... Uh, is that a, oh, that's a... That factory requires coal. We've got coal from somewhere, haven't we? One of the trains, many trains have been taken over. How are our planes doing? Yeah, they're doing phenomenally well. All making a profit. The only issues are some of our vehicles which aren't making a profit. Uh, but soon will be. So we're now... It's now looking good. Um, I'm thinking... Actually, it's probably bad, bad plan. Uh, train income is uh, more than, well, I can't even describe how much that's gone up by. It's not quadrupled, it's more than that. It's sort of and look, that's our plane income. I was the only person to buy planes. They didn't have any planes before, so I've done a good job there. But that's, that's what I mean when you think how cheaty the planes are. Um, now, one little cheat, well not cheat, but sort of um, method of ruining the business for the other company is, uh, sort of, you see where they've got roads and trains, now they don't respond well. You see, like that train there, he's going quite fast. If I were to build a road, now how much does that train Actually, they just go through them, don't they? Um, but I'm just thinking, if I crashed... Well, that would be something that I do have to do in a later episode, because I'm not actually sure whether it holds up the trains or not. Now, is, there a, is that the company that's just down from the airport? I'm in the wrong place completely or entirely. I need to be here at Parderton. Yes, it is just the mill there. Anyway, so this now seems to be going a lot better than it was before. Uh, so I'll end this week in a much stronger position. Uh, so until next time, goodbye. Set up. How about another railway line? Or airport, I mean. Uh, when it comes to railway lines, uh, I think this town need place needs a uh, railway line, that place needs a railway line. Obviously, looking at it, it's going to be a small branch line. We'll have it go all the way around to uh, New Flatten. Here, at back. So, uh, let's have to go building.